The flipped classroom is a classroom that the traditional structure is reversed. The purpose of flipping the classroom is to change passive learning into active. In the flipped classroom, teachers record and post video lectures for the next class. Students then later watch video lectures and write down notes at home on their computers. In the next class, they can ask appropriate questions about the lecture. Furthermore, they can spend their class time actively working, such as problem solving, discussion, and debate instead of passively sitting through lectures. After the initial questions are answered, students are given the assignment for the day. It might be a lab, an inquiry activity, a directed problem solving activity, or test. Teachers can guide students individually when they flip the classroom. There was no enough time for teachers to support students in the traditional classroom because it required teachers' full lecturing time. However, this method enables teachers to support students while they are working with a group or a partner about the lecture they already watched before class. In addition, if students happen to miss the class due to their illness, they can watch the lecture that teachers posted at home. Therefore, they will be able to study what they missed and catch up with other students. Students can also control the video when they don't understand the particular section. Thus, they can watch incomprehensible parts over and over again until they can understand. It also improves students' concentration because they can pause the lecture whenever they experience difficulty on focusing. There are two main steps to use the flipped classroom to enhance learning and teaching. Make videos for students and help students to develop student-created content. First, teacher should make their lecturing video. However, they should keep them short. They need to stick to one topic per video. They should try to keep their videos under 15 minutes and really should put under the 10 minutes. In addition, teachers should add callouts on the videos. A callout is a text box, a shape, or some other object that will appear for a while in the video and then disappear. This helps the student to pay attention to the key elements in a video. Second, Teacher should help students to develop students' created content. Flipped classroom can give students more time to create their own content. Students nowadays have a broad range of ways to create content to demonstrate their understanding of various topics. For example, they can blog, create videos, podcast, and many different educational products, it will be helpful for students to build up their knowledge. Flipping the classroom is an effective way of both teaching and learning. Teachers are no longer have to stand in front of the students and conduct the whole class time. They can now record their lectures, make videos, and post them online. Afterwards, Students can watch the online lectures that the teacher created and then come to class with a prepared attitude. In order to create the successful flipped classroom, teachers should practice a lot to make best videos because they can't make perfect videos on their first try. Furthermore, students should remove distractions for better concentration when they watch the video. The flipped classroom will allow teachers to support students individually and give various opportunities of learning in class. Created using Powtoon.